that I'm going to be using is uh, the is uh, the HP Compact 6005 Pro, which got downgraded to Windows XP. There we go. And yeah, I'm going to have to get Hypercam 2 set up. But yeah, what you're going to be seeing until I can get Hypercam 2 recording is going to be this is going to be external video. And yeah, there's more than one user on this thing, because I wanted to go talk a bit about it, because we have new features immediately. But here we have the Windows XP, one of Windows XP, of the new features to Windows XP. So, with the login slash lock screen. This was introduced in Windows XP, but Chris moved back to it. Windows and the prior to the next official release, which was Codename Whistler development. But prior to Whistler, there was XP was a project called Neptune Odyssey. This is in the uh, Windows Neptune or Microsoft Neptune as it officially is called, is where the user screen is can be found. Look at that. And yeah, if the audio sounds a little wonky, it's because of the fact that if the display and audio look a little wonky, it's because of the fact that I just installed drivers on this thing. So yeah, we have all this stuff, but we need to go start this up. So I have no, I also have no idea if this is going to cause any frame drops or stuff. Because I did not test this program ahead of time. So, yeah. Okay, so that seems to be running fairly fine. So what should we cover first? I think just to get it out of the way, Windows Media Player, which I might have to, which I'm not going to talk in this process, because I have no idea if the original Windows XP Media Player is on here or not, the updated version. So, yeah, it's Windows Media Player. Yeah, this is Windows Media Player 9. You're not going to search the PC for media. By searching computer. Okay, actually, by searching computer, go into uh, search for the out of box in the out of box experience. And So it doesn't seem like we're going to be able to do that. So let's go into... Where is it? So yeah, this is Windows Explorer. This is System32. Which is a big folder that if you delete pretty much 
your on this version when it's all over. So yeah, you have out of box. Sample? No, it's not there. But here is the Windows Media Player. This is what would have originally this plus music would play on the in the out of box experience. And yeah, you also have this. We're not gonna cover it. You're already probably gonna hear it in the future since I have a PC with oh yeah with, with recovery media on it and it is not this PC this is just a placeholder title let's eject that so now that you have an idea of that I'm gonna go to the Windows Media Maker which is another somewhat potentially nostalgic thingy let me just do some magic here. So yes, here it is. I'm only showing this so that you can get an idea of the video transitions. Here are all the transitions. I apologize if that's really... Here are all of the effects. And let's save the project. Okay, there we go. And I'm going to... Do this. This is not going to take a long time. So this is like a 12 second clip. Unlike the original videos clip which pretty much resulted in the conclusion of the video. So this is it. If you want to see it for yourself on in, in, all of its glory without seeing this in the background. Then check it out on my extras channel. Then we have Internet Explorer. Let's see if Google will load. Ah, there it is. Google. This is one of the few. This is the one of the few websites that actually works. As you can tell, <laughs> this does not work properly. This doesn't look right. page cannot be displayed. So that's Internet Explorer, and the reason why I was able to pull that off is because I have the, you know. So let's try Windows Messenger. I don't think this is going to do anything because it's long gone. Outlook Express. You got, which is an email program. You have all of this. Nothing I know here, and I think that since we've covered Outlook Express, it would be really fitting to um, to uh, follow up with Address Book. So this is a, a so this is Address Book. So there you go. You got all your information. And yeah, this is also a reference to the classic era where Steel 64 was in control of the channel, or at least had a pretty important role in the channel. So that's address book. So now let's cover calculator. 64 divided by 2. 32. I am not splitting a picture of one of the PNGs used to for steel 64 in half. You have basic operations. 2 divided by 0 equals cannot divide by 0.
Ha ha! And now we have gone all the way back to 64. Anyway, we should get going on some of these. Let's see, should we cover... Let's cover WordPad. I realized that this is screen recording, so I don't have to do the magic on, so I can... But I'm still, just to be safe, there you go. Just say this is a document. Now we're gonna cover Notepad. Oh, let me just... No, I... I cannot see the keys. I just put same thing instead of same thing. This is a disadvantage of this. We're not gonna cover games, I'm probably gonna do those on my extra channel. So now we have paint. Ah uh, yes, the the worst color combo possible. It makes my it, ah this label this untitled. And we have other things here, but we don't need to cover them unless I really wanted to. Let's see what MSN does. Oh no no. I do not want to... Yeah, it just tries... It just installs MSN. So yeah, that will be it for this video. Let's just... So yeah, it looks like it worked. That will be it for this video. Thanks for watching. I will see you next week. Bye!